Oh fam, there's so much new happening to this truck. It's gonna be crazy. So much new happening, which by the way, the last couple of days driving this thing, um, daily driving this, and I did, by the way, I did drop off Big Stinky this morning to get the front end rebuild done there, doing ball joints, U-joints, tie rods, new brakes, new rotors. They're giving it the work, so they're gonna get everything done. Because um, I told them the same story. I said, hey, you know, and uh, this, is, this was their thing too. They're like, hey, I mean, you know, this has all got to get done and I said yeah definitely I said make sure you just do everything that you think might need done because uh, you know if that is going to be somebody else's truck I want to make sure that you know they're well taken care of you don't want to have somebody win a truck and then feel like great now I got a bunch of work to do you know what I'm saying so um, yeah it's going to cost me a couple thousand bucks to make sure that truck and this truck are perfect in terms of that ends of stuff but definitely worth definitely worth doing for you guys so um, but yeah let's get into the topic of today's video what is up everybody hope you guys are doing absolutely fantastic welcome back to another video here on loud and proud hope you guys are doing absolutely fabulous today I just ran by the bank today and I grabbed some cash to put down on the paint job for the dually so hope you guys are excited so when you guys see the dually it's gonna look totally different like it's gonna look good like right now when you look at this truck obviously it's got the whole heifer hood going on. Typical Dodge thing, it seems like. The Astro is just like that. Um, don't know why their clear coats just sucked on these trucks. But, um, yeah, so it's got a lot of heifer hood going on. Pretty much the whole cab is nasty. And the bed is, like, totally fine. I mean, it's dirty and it's filthy back there. I'm going to try to clean that up a little bit as well. The bed is in pretty darn good shape, but I'm pretty sure he's going to paint the whole truck, obviously. So everything's perfect and it's all the same. But really there's nothing to really do on this truck. Like there's like some orange here, but this is from before the flaps and everything were mounted back on. Um, it's like rock chip, you know. I don't know how else to say it. It's kind of like rocks flew up there, chipped the paint, and then just kind of got that real light surface rust type of stuff um, showing up on there. But other than that, I mean, it's not like you know, there's no like holes, no damage, stuff like that. So there's some stuff in the works, there's some stuff on the way. But the goal for today is to remove the badging on the truck since I am planning to drop the truck off in the next day or two. By the time you guys see the next video, it'll probably be dropping it off or dropped off. I'll let you guys know and then uh, you guys can go actually, you guys can check out his channel if you guys want to see the process. If you don't want to see the process, then obviously, you know, whatever, but he's going to film the process of doing it as much as he can. Guys, we're going to get to removing some of the badging on this truck. I'm not sure this video is going to be too long, um, but that's kind of just the job that I had to do today that I wanted to get done. So we're going to get to removing the badging. Hopefully it's not too difficult. Yo, loud and proud we are back and it has been a couple of days since I filmed and I'm so sorry guys It's been three or four days since I put a video up last and guys. I have just been working 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 this giveaway stuff has been keeping me pretty busy. Um, not to mention We've got a lot of stuff to talk about a lot of new things have happened I've got a big reveal for you guys I'm gonna show you some parts before I show you the whole truck. So like I said It needed new tie rods U joints ball joints and it also got, you can see where that's mounted up in there, new inner axle shafts, okay? I mean, they gave this thing the works, and I told them to do everything. I'm just do everything. I don't want anybody getting this truck and then being like, oh, you know, something breaks on them, you know what I'm saying? So they did everything. Um, new brakes, rotors, pads. I mean, just, I mean, uh, brakes and pads might be the same thing. Anyways, they, just, they did everything. Okay, they got everything perfect. And so now we have the truck with the new wheels and tires on it as well. I already kind of showed you guys what it would kind of look like with the wheels in front of it. But on the truck, guys, it looks so mean. It looks really, really good. Um, I'm going to put the mirrors down really quick. I just got done taking some pictures. So I put the mirrors up because, you know, it's just, for, just for the photos, you know what I'm saying? It, it makes it look kind of cool. So I hope you guys are ready. We're going to do a little montage. This thing looks sick.
So everybody, there you go in all of her glory. And you know what the best part is, guys? This truck could be yours. So if you guys have not heard the news yet, you guys can go to team with that little dash LNP dot myshopify.com every twenty dollars you spend on t-shirts like green handles only or the new releases lots of new releases since i talked to you guys last um on on the youtube you know um we have the i make money you make excuses t-shirt we have all kinds of stuff that just is like for you you dudes okay you hard working guys with your trucks your cars and stuff like that just some really cool stuff a lot of people are just killing this stuff you guys just love it and uh, I've had a lot of guys like, dude, like, even when the giveaway's over, can I just keep coming back to buy more of this stuff? Because it's it's such cool stuff. I'm like, of course, you know, like you can you can always do that. But I'm gonna try to offer up a new item as soon as this one's over. Try to offer up something else. Maybe probably not a truck. The very next thing, but offer up something so that if you guys are gonna be spending your money anyways, your hard-earned cash, just because you want them. Why not be entered in to win something at the same time, you know, no matter what. I'm just going to keep on trying to try to make something an option for you guys to win. Even if you don't really care about the giveaway, but you just want the stuff, why not win something free at the same time? A lot of cool stuff in the works, but I got to talk to you guys about a couple quick things. But like I said, link in description, go to the store. Every $20 you spend will get you an automatic entry to win this truck, okay? We got all kinds of sick, sick, sick stuff, t-shirts and just everything. I got the old third gen wheels in here. I'm not sure what I want to do with them. The tires are pretty much junk. Some of them have nails in them. Um, if somebody wants to buy the the you know the tires and wheels off me, shoot me an offer. I will sell them pretty pretty cheap just to get rid of them. So like I was saying, we've got some things to talk about. Aside from there being a lot of new stuff, like we have a shirt that says, "I'm proud to say I drive a you know it's like a gas guzzling tire shredding 10 MPG getting all American V8, which goes for your cars, SUVs, your trucks, and pretty much anything with a V8 in it. And then you've also got the T-shirts that are um, you know it says all the same stuff except for all American pickup truck versus V8. Just go check it out. There's some really really cool stuff on there and. Uh, yeah, get it while you can, because you could be winning a truck with your purchase as well. Just keep that in mind. Also, some other questions I got to answer. I had some people asking, so hey, what if I spend $10 here, $10 there, $10 there, but I can't just spend, you know, all the money that I want to to get entries at the same time? Does that even count, or does it have to be every order has to be over 20 bucks? No, pretty much if you spend any amount of money, let's say you spend $21, and you spend $32, and you spend $56, we take, we search your name in the bar, Okay, and every order under your name all comes up to one amount. So if you spent, you know, a bunch of small orders, but at the end of the month, it all totals up to one big number, anything that you spend between now and July 2nd counts towards your overall entries. It all gets added together. You know what I'm saying? Even if you had an order that was less than 20, but you had another order that was like worth 30, it's gonna get added together to get your total entries based on how much you spent throughout the whole time of the giveaway, not just each order individually based on how much you spent on those. So all that aside, en enough of that stuff, let's just talk about the, the progress of the builds for those of you who just wanna know that stuff. Um, the dually, I did take the dually to somebody to get painted yesterday, okay? So a lot of stuff's been happening. Um, like I said, all the, all the stuff on Big Sink, he's pretty much good to go. We got a couple horsepower parts we're gonna try to order in for that truck real quick to, you know, just make it that much more lively. Um, the truck, dude, it drives like a Cadillac now. Now that we have, it's got a whole new front end. I mean, axle shafts, every, we did everything. I was like, if you're gonna be in there, just do everything. Okay, so they, I mean, they did everything up front. So it's perfect, all new parts, awesome. So um, this truck is pretty much good to go, except for just a few small things I wanna do to it. Um, and then the dually. Dually under the hood is pretty much good to go. We did the turbo injectors, governor springs, valve springs, all that fun stuff. Um, and then we also did um, the, the tires are here. I didn't show you guys the tires yet. I think I kind of want to wait on that a little bit. So, uh, but anyways, the Dooley's tires are here and spacers are almost here for the rear end on that thing. Bumpers on the way, brackets are on the way. Gosh, a lot of stuff. This has been an expensive couple days when I've been gone. And then also I dropped it off for paint and I put half down. Um, and actually a subscriber is doing it and he's got a channel himself. So um, he's he's painting the truck. I'm a little bit nervous because I'm not, I, it can't turn out worse, you know what I'm saying? Like the truck already is, I mean, clear coats flaking, paints fading, I mean it's bad. But he's like, dude, he's like, I got this, you know, I was like ranked, you know, in the top of my class for, you know, quality of work and, you know, just going out of the way to make sure stuff's done right and just stuff like that. Like he's like, I like I, I will do a good job, you know, like he, he wanted to do it. You know, it's not like I, I'm trying to get somebody that kind of knows how to paint to try to convince him to pay my truck, like he wanted to take on the job. And he knows what's at stake. He's like, man, he's like, I'm a little nervous. It is a giveaway truck, but 
I think you're gonna you're gonna be really happy when you see it. You know, we're gonna make sure everything's polished, everything's gonna be perfect, it's gonna be awesome. So I'm like, okay, man, I'm trusting you with this. You know what I mean? Like, there's a lot on the line. You know, like it's it's a giveaway truck. You know, but he knows that, and I'm pretty excited to uh, see it done. Now, in terms of paint, we are gonna go with the same color with some small variations, not, not, not much, but just some very slight variations. You guys will see that the truck's gonna look different when you guys see it next. It's going to look really good. We should see it in about two weeks with the dually back. I'm excited, really excited. But see, here's the thing guys, like I said with this stuff, I'm trying to do my videos. I know you guys, some of you guys that just wanna see videos every day, I understand, I'm sorry. Um, but I'm trying to get to a point where when I do my YouTube videos, I'm enjoying it. Like I'm having so much fun right now just standing in front of the camera um, versus like stressing it like, oh, I gotta come up with this, I gotta do that, I gotta try to throw together some little project just to get some video out. Like that's what I did every single day and I got to a point now where I'm just like, if I'm gonna take that camera, I wanna do it when I've got some news for the people, like some fun, cool stuff just happened, like some interesting stuff is about to go down, like parts are on the way, like when there's a lot to bring up. Like there's so much happening in three days. You know what I mean, but if it was broken up into four videos, you guys probably would have been, it wouldn't have been quite as exciting to hear it, you know, little tiny bits at a time. But um, yeah, I mean, I don't know. I'm enjoying it. Life is good. Just one more look around the truck and then we're probably gonna wrap it up. But uh, man, just look at her. So clean. Just one more quick little walk around. By the way, the guy who paint, who is painting the dually, I'm gonna leave his YouTube channel, he has a YouTube channel, I'm gonna leave it in the description below for you guys or down in the comment section, um, so you guys can go and watch the progress on that just as much as I am. And uh, it's not on my channel, but I uh, just so, so you guys can see that content happening. Um, if you guys wanna keep up with that, I will leave a link in the description for his channel. Keep up with the dually's progress, even though it's not here for me to film. Um, it's gonna be getting done down there, so. Yeah, definitely go check him out. Super cool guys over there, and I'm excited to see how it turns out. A lot of new stuff happened since I saw you guys last, and a lot more new stuff is about to happen. We've got a lot of stuff going down in the next couple weeks, a lot of stuff. So if you guys don't want to miss out on an opportunity to win one of these trucks, guys, I'm not allowed to tell you how many people are entered, okay? But let me just tell you, if you're one of those people that thinks there's thousands of people entering, there are not. Okay, there, I can't tell you, but let's just say if I would have known how few people were actually in the giveaway right now compared to how many people there are on the channel subscribed, I would be like a no-brainer entering that thing. Like you are not gonna have, you're never gonna see another truck giveaway with this few entries probably ever again. Guys, I'm telling you, this is a crazy opportunity. I mean, you could be driving this truck home or the dually Brand new tires, brand new front end stuff done. Like, I mean, brand new brakes, rotors, pat, I mean, just everything's done. Like they're done, like they are good to go. Solid, reliable trucks in great shape. Not, neither of them have rusted out bodies. Neither of them have, neither of the trucks have frame damage or anything like, like I picked two really good trucks to give away to people. So well, I guess one truck's gonna be given away, but you know what I'm saying? Like I gave, I got two really good trucks um, to put up as an option. If you guys are interested in entering in on this giveaway, like I said, don't forget, link in description, link in the comment section, get enter while you can. While stuff lasts, you could be winning a freaking truck, a mint truck. But yeah, anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash that thumbs up, leave your comments down below, subscribe if you are new, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.